looks nice. Hello? Come in. Sounds a uh, sounds Mediterranean resort. Number 402. Don't look at me. Have you got the corridor? Just here. Come in. Let me just show you this part of the, uh, the uh, luxurious hotel room. And you've got our own washing machine uh, fit with tumble dryer and basin. Come in here. And you've got a bathroom fitted with bath. Sink, of course the toilet is just behind the door there. Uh, yes, it's a, a, a two door room, of course we can go through to the bedroom. Both Phil, <laughs> both Phil and I are sleeping. Chilled out week. Perfect. It's more of a holiday. Wasn't really There's a lot of bags up. There's just the two of us uh, for a week. If you've seen the pictures, flipping nice apartment for you know, pretty pay much. Yeah. But the beach was, uh, you know, beach is nice. doorstep. It was really nice. Um, we we uh, checked out the waves. Just the weather was a bit dodgy. Wasn't it? There's some good footage of us in the waves. <clears throat> yeah. So. Um, yeah. Yo, what's up? It's Jaggy down under here, and uh, we're now in Gold Coast. Come on. This is Burley Heads. We have the hotel right behind you. This is the Mediterranean Resort. Here we go. Burley Beach. A little bit overcast today, isn't it, Alexander? Huh? A little bit overcast today, isn't it, Alexander? Oh, it is, yeah. Just a little bit. Uh, it was worse this morning, though. It's actually picked up, so... You know. It was good yesterday, though. Here we go. This is... Uh, Ch Chaggy is a private beach. Private beach. Yep, see? and checked out the queue deck. Um, loads of nice views around Gold Coast. We were only up there for about two minutes. Um, 
This is Peggy. There's um, Q-Dip. Q-Dip. Look at that. Yeah. Unbelievable. Thanks so much. Yeah, it wasn't. It was oh, too much. Once we got the pictures, that's yeah, it. That's all we needed. It's a bit like most things I have. You can't really spend a day out there. No. Um, and then... Uh, and then we left the Gold Coast. It all seems like so long ago. And then we had to... We had to get a train up to Brisbane Airport by ourselves. We actually got a taxi from um, the place we're staying at, and uh, the people at reception and the place we're staying were like, "You want to pay now? This is the day before we went. Do you want to pay the taxi now or tomorrow morning when we go?" And I was like, "I don't know my card on me or the money, so I'll pay for it tomorrow." Got to tomorrow. Uh, receptionists were so terrible; they almost forgot to ask my the key for the room back. I just remembered, thanks to Tina reminding me. And then we got in the taxi, hadn't paid for it yet, so I just assumed we'd pay the taxi when we drive when we get there. Ta- got there, taxi driver didn't say anything, and we were just like, okay, we'll walk off and not pay for it. So we got away with that one, that saved us got 50 bucks. journey, yeah. Good. And it also paid for the train. Yeah, ticket as well, didn't it? A free so, journey to Brisbane Airport. Brisbane Airport. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we got to Brisbane Airport, and off we went to Cairns. <laughs> Thank you. 